Thanks for tuning in. In this video, you will learn what you need to know about signing up for a Weebly website and how you can get your own domain name. To create a new, free account, just go to Weebly.com and enter your information. After you fill out this box, you can choose your website's name. All that's left now is the category of your site. On the following page, it gets interesting, because here you choose what kind of domain you're going to use. The first option is to register a Weebly subdomain. It will be something like myname.weebly.com. If you want to get rid of the Weebly branding in your domain name, you can purchase a professional domain directly from Weebly. It will be myname.com or myname.net, for example. It goes without saying that the domain name still has to be available. Registering a domain name through Weebly will cost you around $30. Another option is to point a domain you already own to your Weebly site. This comes with a word of warning. You need to change the name server entries for your domain, which is a bit of a technical matter. Weebly provides detailed instructions of how this works, but if you're not 100% sure what you have to do, please ask the company where you bought the domain name for advice. I would also recommend that you always register a free Weebly subdomain because you can basically keep it forever and it doesn't cost a thing. That said, we'll just go with option 1 for now and click continue. Please also check out our next video where we'll give you a detailed review on Weebly's editor. In case you have any questions, please leave a comment. And if you've enjoyed this video, I'd be very happy if you could like it on YouTube or Facebook.